In this video, we're going to talk about how to find the area of a scalene triangle. Now keep in mind, a scalene triangle is a triangle where all three sides are different. An isosceles triangle is when you have two sides that have the same length. And for an equilateral triangle, that's when all three sides have the same length. But because all the sides are different, we have a scaling triangle. Now, in order to calculate the area of a scaling triangle, we have to use Heron's formula. First, we need to find S. S is one half of the sum of all three sides. So basically, S is one half the perimeter. Once we know the value of S, we can plug it into this formula to get the area of the scaling triangle. So it's the square root of s times s minus a times s minus b times s minus c. So let's say that a is 15. We're going to say that b is 16 and c is 19. It doesn't really matter the order in which you assign them. So you'll still get the same answer. Now, let's calculate one half of the perimeter. So this is going to be 15 plus 16 plus 19 divided by 2. 15 plus 16 is 31. 31 plus 19 is 25. No, that's 50. 50 divided by 2 is 25. I automatically jump to the final answer. So S is 25 in this problem. Now let's calculate the area using the second formula. So we have S minus A, 25 minus 15, and then S minus B, 25 minus 16, and S minus C, 25 minus 19. 25 minus 15 is 10. 25 minus 16 is 9. And 25 minus 19 is 6. So what I like to do is I like to take out the perfect squares. 25 is a perfect square. 9 is a perfect square. And we're left with 10 and 6. But 10, I'm going to break that into 5 and 2. And 6 is 3 times 2. 2 times 2 is 4, so we could take that perfect square out. And we're left with 5 times 3, which is 15. The square root of 25 is 5. The square root of 9 is 3. The square root of 4 is 2. And so that's what we have left over at the moment. Five times three is 15 and 15 times two is 30. So the exact answer is 30 times the square root of 15 units squared. So if this was in feet, this would be in square feet. If this was in inches, the final answer would be in square inches. So that's the exact answer, but let's get an approximation. So let's turn that into a decimal. 30 times the square root of 15 is approximately 116.19, if you round it, square units. So that's it. Now you know how to calculate the area of a scalene triangle, or the area of any triangle when you know all three sides. The key is to use Heron's formula. So remember first, just to review, step one is to calculate S, which is one half of the perimeter. So you add up all three sides, then divide by two. Once you have S, you could then plug it into this formula to get the area. You just need to simplify the radical and you can get the final answer. 